Hello Twin Flames and welcome to your quick five minute energy check in for Wednesday. So thank you angels. What do we need to know? Well, so first of all, I mean, they come out for a reason this way. Look what we've got here. First of all, we've got cancer energy, which is where we are now. So this is the energy of cancer, the month. Okay, so obviously July. What are they planning? This has been coming up over and over again. What's next? What are they planning? Even in today's DM to DF reading, it was the mask and saying, I'm planning our future. I'm planning how we can get away and start again. And we've got what is the divine mask and healing right now. So we know he's healing issues around commitment, his own responsibilities, his own insecurities. He's healing things in his life to be free for you, to start again. So these are the things he's planning. We've got Libra and energy. Now Libra is about balance. So I feel this could possibly be the energy the angels want you to be aware of between Cancer energy, which is in July, and the Libra energy that will be flowing in. So obviously we've got Cancer, we've got Leo in August, we've got Virgo in September, and then as we move forward, like September, October, we've got Libra. At least I think that's the way it is. So between now and Libra energy, the dates there, this is what they give me a timeline. But remember, a timeline is a guideline. This is when things are going to fall into place because this is the energy where the masculines are becoming more balanced and more focused and more able to see clearly what they need to do. The energy around same sex twin flames is, is the same. So, you know, maybe you're a same sex twin flame and you, you're thinking, does this affect me then? How does this affect my connection? It's the same energy. That's why, you know, I haven't been doing focused same-sex twin flame readings because it's the same energy and you're being reminded of this. So even though these are question cards, I don't feel I need to use a deck today at all to give you the answer because it's already coming through. So you're being shown that whatever the difference is between you, whatever the gaps are, the masculines are planning to walk away from their life now to begin again and start afresh with the divine feminine. We've got three cards spread. So this is showing you that everything has fallen into place. Everything is moving where it's meant to be. The divine feminine, the divine masculine and the journey. And what is the divine masculine learning right now? To let go of fear, to trust this journey, to give it to heaven. And what's being created, a new beginning. So I'm really feeling that I don't need to answer, you know, to use cards because the angels are clearly showing this. But because it said three cards spread, I'm going to use some masculine messages. So I'm going to use Divine Masculine Messages to Divine Feminine by George. Now, so what I'm feeling is in same-sex connections, and that's an extra special message for you guys today. And in all connections between now and Libra Energy, the masculines are moving towards the divine feminine. They are making their move. They are making changes. They are working out how you can be together. And they are clearing up all their commitments and responsibilities to make this happen. So what's being created? A new start. A favourable outcome. A new beginning. The situation is already resolved. So today's daily twin flame reading will really resonate with you. So I'm going to use this deck. This is George's deck, Blue Eyes Tarot, my DM. So what's being created? We're going to do a three card spread. Wow. Automatically that one jumps out powerful. What do we need to know? Let me just show you how I'm doing these cards. So, you know, I just shuffle and then I know when they're ready. There they are. So what's being created? A mission. We have a mission together. So he's saying to you, well, we have a mission together. So of course we're going to be together. As I walk on this earth, I feel closer to you. So what's being created? Closeness. Lessons being learned to bring you together. Walking on the earth to grow and evolve and transform and come together. Also, I will always remember how special you are. So what's being created is special memories. Memories in their mind. Thoughts of you. They are thinking about you. They're creating those moments in the mind. And they don't want it to be a past tense either. They want it to be a now and a future energy. So the message is between now and Libra energy, okay, things are heating up. Things are moving forward, which you know anyway. And, you know, the swan is also a big sign about divine feminine grace and beauty. And two swans is about union. And, you know, it's just beautiful. And the other night, you know, I did some washing. And I shared this on the community post, but it just jumped in my head. I did some washing and I put the, you know, because I want it to dry in the house. 
you know, I put the, the kind of clothes stands up and I put the washing on the clothes stands in the bedroom. And I went to bed earlier than George because obviously I'm getting all these readings done for my holiday and stuff. And he's got a top with a lion on. You may have seen it on his channel. Okay, it stands out so strong. And I didn't know because I was just putting the washing out. And when I got in bed, the lion was directly facing me and it was just looking at me and it was watching me. And even when George came to bed and we turned the light off, it was glowing up in the dark, you know, it was illuminated. And I feel that's a big message about strength for the divine feminine, strength for the divine masculine, but also the energy of the Lionsgate portal, power flowing in. And to get that Libra energy coming up as well, I love it when the angels give us timelines because, yes, the guidelines, but it's always a big sign of power coming in. So between now and Libra energy, I'm going to find out the exact dates. In fact, let's do it now. And, you know, some of you are Libras and you'll be knowing exactly when it is because that may be your birthday. So I'm just Googling here the dates of Libra. September the 22nd to about, it says, October the 23rd. So between now and October, huge shifts coming in to bring balance. I feel some of you guys could come into union. I know some of you already are. Even though 2023 and 24 are the years of union and commitment, but big things. So I feel there's going to be a lot of karmic endings between, you know, now the cancer energy and the Libra energy. So that's the message as well coming through. Karmic endings between now and then. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.